Andrew Shannon, we're on Cash Dollar Road in Forward Township, and this is where the boys were hit, and this is where they were found. And almost every year since then, family and friends have come together in this spot for a vigil to remember them. And also, take note of this sign. Someone knows, could it be you? Scott Fosnott would have turned 31 on the 25th, and Sean Bauer would have turned 31 on Saturday. We spoke to Bauer's parents before the vigil at their home because they weren't sure if they were going to make it to the vigil. The feeling of loss is still there. They want someone to come forward, tell them what happened so that they can have some peace. The only thing these families know is that their kids were hit by a vehicle and left to die on this road best friend. It's just heartbreaking that I lost them and it's been so long and no one's come forward or admitted anything or any clues of what happened. God will have his way with the killer. You know, I just want to know what happened. And this vigil begins at six. You could see some family members still here and we're going to talk to the other boy's mother and then we'll bring that to you at six. Also coming up at six, when that vigil starts, we'll bring it to you live. Reporting live in Forward Township, Alyssa Raymond, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.